Hey guys, it's Kudasai coming at you with more Animal Crossing A New Horizons. And the reason why I'm talking so quietly is because it is very late and I don't want to wake up the other humans in my house. So this is going to be more of a chill episode of Animal Crossing. But as you can hear from the music in the background, this festive tune, it is bunny day. Just very late at night, so there are... Um, there are um, a few stores that are closed today, but that's okay, because we have stuff to do. Oh wow, nice Eugene, rocking it with your earth egg outfit. <laughs> Late at night, how are you doing Eugene? How are you doing? I was taking a stroll on the beach when I saw a bottle as colorful as a bunny day egg lying in the surf. I didn't read the note inside, but I can only assume its appearance has something to do with Bunny Day. Either that, or the writer collects unusually shaped bottles and throws them in the ocean. Yes, hoping that their long lost love will find one and use the shape as a clue to reunite with their beloved. The screenplay practically writes itself, yeah buddy. Yeah, it does, it truly does. Well, you could uh, go enjoy your fantasy over there while I continue to give my intro because I'm not done yet. So as you guys know, since the release of Animal Crossing New Horizons, Bunny Day is the first official holiday since its launch. Which is amazing because I have no idea what's in store for us. I have been busy literally all day, so I had no time to record until now. But I had to get a video out. Like, that was just what I had to do. I wasn't going to sleep tonight until I got at least one video rolled out for you guys, so here I go! And here is lovely Zipper T Bunny, Hoppy. Hoppy as always, so I haven't talked to him yet, which means that you and I are going to experience this for the very first time. So, hello Zipper T Bunny, cheerful and jovial as always. Boingity boing, hey there Skipper, it's me, Zipper. I'm the lucky yellow bunny and I'm here to say there's something super special hippity happening today. Yay, let's all clap. Anytime now. Yeah, no, no one's gonna clap. Do I remember you? Well, of course I do. I never forget a friendly face, especially one I met in a new place. Looks like we kept my visit a secret. I'm surprised you actually listened. Of course I did. Anyway, my favorite day is finally here. Time to fill this island with lots of bunny cheer. Hip hop hooray! Are you ready to celebrate Bunny Day? I guess so. Great, say it with me now. The time has come. Let's look for eggs. That's my bunny plan. They're here, they're there, they're everywhere. Find them if you can. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? No, I have absolutely no idea. Your your poetic words of wisdom are not processing in my brain. You can still hunt for eggs on this special day. Use your time wisely and try to find the six types of eggs hidden around the island. If you find all six types, I'll give you a funny bunny reward. You know what? I also have a surprise for some bunny, very special. Oh, <gasps> oh. A DIY recipe! And that some bunny is you! Here's the bunny day arch recipe to say thanks for all you do. Aww. Well then, you better hop to it if you're going to find each and every bunny day DIY recipe I've hidden. I have a super extra special reward for anyone who crafts all my bunny day recipes. Now no time to waste, make haste! But... Zipper! Hold on, you just gave me a reason to show all of those lovely viewers out there my house. Because, as you can see by my extremely festive Bunny Day Queen outfit, yes, I am known as the Bunny Day Queen in this, in this outfit. But anyway, he gave me a very, very special reason to show you guys the inside of my house. Because I spent a lot of time last night decorating it for this Bunny Day season, this especially, specifically. But as you can see... It is extremely festive in here. I have got every single Bunny Day DIY recipe already crafted here. As you can see, I have got my lovely Bunny Day vanity sitting right next to my big, chunky, plushy teddy bear. I have got- well, this isn't actually a, a Bunny Day DIY recipe, but it's my little windflower fan that I thought would be a nice touch in this very Easter-esque setting. I have got my- bunny clock over here my um my bunny day crown which i was considering wearing but decided that i would wear this hat instead because look at that brim look at the size of this brim the girth on this baby is oh it's gorgeous but anyway moving on we have our two merry and festive balloons over here we have our if you guys remember from the last video that i posted i have my little 
uh, pea chi no, chickpea, chick, I have my little chick outfit here, my little baby chick costume, right, just casually sitting right there next to this bunny day bed, my egg bed, which I like to roll around in a lot, I spent, don't, don't question me, but I spent quite a bit of time just rolling back and forth on that bed, and I'm not gonna question it, and neither will you, so, that's just a secret between you and me, let's just keep it that way. Anyway, moving on, I've got my, uh, my bunny day closet here. I have got my bunny day stools, too. I have. I have my little other teddy plushie, my teddo bear, which I just placed back fr from my, um, my original interior setup. But anyway, this is the only room that I have got that is celebratory, that is very, um, bunny day, bunny day, um, specific. So yeah, that's pretty much it. But anyway, moving on, we shall not delay because we have eggs to capture. And I have got a limited amount of time to do it, so here we go! No time to waste, we are getting started immediately. So, what we have to do is catch a bunch of eggs, one of each, and I completely forgot about this. I completely forgot that I had all of these bunny day costumes here. Well, I guess those will just be decorations for now. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, I also put a bunny day fence surrounding the, the resident services center just for just to add a little festive touch but anyway moving on also wait before i even move on i have to say hold on i found earlier this morning i found a secret with um with zipper t bunny and really it's it's not really a secret but i kind of figured this out while i was walking back and forth that if you go really far away and then you return to zipper t bunny He won't be hopping anymore. He's not hopping. He doesn't know I'm here. He doesn't know a thing. Oh, and I like how the balloons move. Ooh, oh dear, well. Oh, uh, mom. Uh, oops, oopsie. Oopsie poopsie. Sorry. Anyway, Pinky, before I even get started, sorry for keep continuously getting distracted here, guys, but I didn't even, I didn't get to see any of this. Like, this is all brand new to me. Anyway, Pinky, hi! Oh dear. Pinky, hi, hello. Oh, so I took a walk down by the water. Oh, hold on, I gotta give her like this, um, this very chatty, chatty girl tone. Oh, so I took a walk down by the water looking for some inspiration for my newest hit song. And I saw one of those message bottles covered in bunny day colors. I totes should have checked it out, but just then these epic lyrics came to me. They went like, oh, oh, message in a bottle, oh, oh, makes me hungry for a waffle. Anywho, I rushed home to write them down so I wouldn't forget them. But you should definitely go down there and check it out. Maybe you'll find something. Or maybe you'll find the inspiration for a song, yas. Oh no, wait, Pinky. Oh, oh dear, Pinky has claimed the catchphrase of yas. I completely forgot who I gave that catchphrase to, but it's spreading like plague over here. Where is that? Oh, there you are. So our first egg of the night, of this fine night, is going to be a sky egg. Of which I have too many. <laughs> I have way too many for my own good of these things. And I'm probably just going to use them all to craft a bunch of uh, sky egg costumes and then sell them for tons of bells. Which I am in desperate need of. But anyway, besides that, we have stuff to do, things to see. And while I'm at it, I guess I might as well show you guys the bit of landscaping that I've done with my place. As you can see, I've got a little islet over here, a little fountain sitting right in the middle, surrounded by a couple of trees, which I find very beautiful. I've got my museum up these stairs, but anyway, that's not the point. Murph, oh, Murphy, Murphy, hey, 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 rocking a water egg costume over here. You see those colorful balloons floating around? I swear even the skies have caught putting day fever. The current things too. Gifts, I reckon. I have a mind to shoot some of those blimps down and find out. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm pretty aware of that, Murphy. Oh, wait. I just realized something. Okay, so I don't think I'm going to be catching any, um, or digging up any earth eggs since I might have accidentally, um, I might have accidentally dug them all up this morning. Which I apologize deeply for, but maybe this is a water egg. 
<gasps> it's a water egg. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Cool. Uh, hey, hey, Pinky. You do, you do you, you do your thing. So anyway, I am at a loss here only because I think I've already harvested all of the eggs that this island has to offer, so... I'm, uh, I'm gonna try to do a bit of a cheat over here. And I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but... I'm gonna see if it counts if I take all of my eggs from my inventory and show them to, uh, show them to Zipper T Bunny over here and see if he takes them. At least pray that he takes them. Because I wouldn't want to have ruined Bunny Day by taking all the eggs before I talk to him. That would be horrible. But anyway, he also said that I have to craft a bunch of, um, a bunch of his DIY stuff, so I already did that. I'm not too sure if it counts if I just have them in my house or if I have to take everything out of my house and then show them to him, which would be horrible. What is that? What the? Whoa! Did you guys see that? What the heck? Did you? T please tell me you guys saw that. Over there, right where Murphy's house is. Did you see that spider floating in the air? What the heck? What the heck? I'm gonna have to zoom in for that, for you guys, just to see if you guys didn't catch that at all. But, oh my gosh. I saw that spider. That was the first thing I saw, and there is a spider here. I know there's a tarantula somewhere over here. There has to be. Please tell me it's not behind his house. Please tell me. Please, 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 please. Okay, it's, it's not here. What? What? That is insane. What the? What? 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 Okay, I am, I am flabbergasted by that. And if you guys didn't catch that, I promise I'm going to zoom in on that for you guys because that blew my mind that was so weird oh jeez i completely forgot it was tarantula time it's the time where all the tarantulas come out to play and that's not fun at all but uh anyway anyway uh hey pietro if you're looking for something fun to do in celebration of bunny day might i suggest you take a shake a few trees apparently you just may be rewarded with a beautifully decorated egg goalie I'd love to show you one myself, but I've shaken over a hundred trees and I've gotten nothing to show for it. What if it's a bunny day curse? If it's a curse, I don't know what to tell you. I'm sorry, Pietro. <gasps> Guys. I'm sorry I'm procrastinating so much. But this is a must-have. This Atlas Moth is a must-have. Oh, well. That's fine. I guess. Anyway, did I just see Bricolo? <gasps> Bricolo! Oh, you have a stone egg costume. Oh, you look so adorable. Ah, you look so adorable. I bit into a candy egg I found on the beach and it wasn't a candy egg at all. It was a message bottle. I think maybe there was a DIY recipe inside or something. Once I found out it wasn't candy, I lost interest. Oh dear. Well, anyway, we have Zipper T Bunny to talk to. Also, before I even talk to him, I want to... I want to show you guys something, just because I'm... For, for all of you guys out there who don't know who Zipper T Bunny is, he is basically the master of celebrations for Easter. Or for Bunny Day, I mean. Sorry sorry about that, it's not Easter in Animal Crossing, it's, uh, it's Bunny Day. And just for all of you guys out there who don't know who's his secret, if you turn a... If you go behind him, and you turn him around... He says, excuse me, but could you please stop staring at my back? It's rude. But you could see right there that he has a zipper on the back of his quote-unquote suit. No one knows for certain if that's actually a suit, but some, some claim that he's actually not a real bunny. Even though he claims that he is, he is really not. And I have my suspicions about him as well. I, I think he's actually a human in disguise. He's disguised as a, as a, as a bunny day bunny. But, you know, who knows? He's one of the few mysteries in Animal Crossing that we may never get to uncover. But anyway. Won't find anything back there anyway. Um, I believe I already found your secret zipper. But anyway, besides that, stop jangling your zipper and talk to me! Oh yeah, I forgot to mention something kind of important earlier. 
Here's the deal. If you're ever short by one egg of a certain type, I can help you out. I'll give you one egg of your choice, and all you have to do is give me three of a different type of egg. Bippity bop, not a bad deal, eh? All you need to say is, let's trade, and I'll know what you mean. Oh yeah, I know. I know. I'm aware. So did you need something? I have eggs. Let's see indeed. Oh! I like how his voice actually sounds like he's counting the eggs. Like, one, two, three. Four, five, six. <laughs> Wonderfully wonderful. You have all six types of eggs. Yippity skippity yay. All right, I'm gonna take one of each egg type. Is that okay? <laughs> Go for it. Not my problem. I have way too many for my own good. All right, here you are. <gasps> what is it? <gasps> it's a bunny day basket. <gasps> It's time to celebrate, here we go. Boingity yay, hip hop hooray, what a wonderful, thunderful egg filled day. All right, good, enjoy the rest of your bunny day. Wait. Okay, first of all, I just wanna say that he sounds like, or the way that I, I give him his voice, it really sounds like he's like a Dr. Seuss type of, type of character, but I'm not gonna question that. And second of all, what? A basket? Wait. Oh, no, oh, I thought it was a holdable I item. I didn't think that it was a piece of furniture. Well, anyway, now that I have it, I guess I will put it in my uh, in my house. And also, I bought turnips today, just for you guys out there who are curious. Curious, I bought 100, a 200, a 300 turnips, which I'm hoping I'm going to be able to sell tomorrow for a profit, a handsome profit. But as you guys all know, my town sucks when it comes to the turnip market. But anyway, I have a basket to place, so I guess I'll put it right here because it seems fitting. <gasps> oh, that is indeed fitting. That is one fitting basket indeed. Oh, I love it. It's beautiful. Yes. 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 Oh, beautiful. And also, third of all, is that was that all that I had to do for Bunny Day? Just collect six eggs and then get a basket or a mm. I'm a little confused but you know I think what I'm gonna do now because I feel like I did everything I well I didn't do anything wrong but I think I wasn't supposed to decorate my house with all of this stuff so I think what I have to do is completely demolish my bunny day setup and then, unfortunately, replace it all when I show it to Zipper T Bunny because I guess he wants to see this stuff. He wants to, uh, he wants proof that I officially crafted every DIY recipe in the book. So I guess I'm gonna do that. But before I even start doing that, wait, hold on. Why did I, what, why did I put everything back into my inventory? Okay, that was my mistake. Hold on, guys, while I get everything back into my pocket so I could craft the arch. Oh, hold on. Uno momento. Okay, we're good. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna craft the Bunny Day arch, and then I'm gonna go back to Zipper T Bunny real quick and just confirm that I do have to show him one of each piece of furniture. And then I'm gonna see what I get from that, because I know that there is one more DIY recipe that I haven't gotten yet, and that is... On my that is on the top of my list of things to do this bunny day season. So anyway, gotta head into my inventory real quick. Learn the bunny day arch recipe. Huh, okay. And I know I'm going over time with this video, but you know, I wanted to squeeze all of the bunny day festivities into one video, so it's gonna I don't know how long it's gonna last, but when I'm when I'm done, I'm done. I'm already at twenty one minutes, so that's a problem. But that's okay. I need one more earth egg. Ah, hold on guys, one more second while I get my earth egg. Okay, got that, we're good. Now I can craft the arch at last. Okay, here it is. Cool, cool. I made a bunny day arch. Wonderful. Bellissimo. Now we gotta show this to Zipper T Bunny over here. And then I'm gonna see if I really have to destroy my entire Bunny Day setup, which I put so much time and effort into making. <laughs> anyway, hey, Zipper. What now, did I hair you correctly? You crafted all the recipes I hid around the island? 
My oh my, I knew you'd try. But you rarely finished the task, which leaves me nothing left to ask. <gasps> so I don't have to destroy my setup. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Zipper. I love you. Except this one other thing. Wait, what? Did you really think it'd be that easy? Ugh, kids today have it so good. That's right, I needed to do one more thing before I give you your reward. Take this recipe and I'll explain. Oh no, not another one. This final challenge fills me with glee. You gotta craft a toy that looks like me. Yes siree, it's a wobbling zipper toy. Craft this recipe and the super D duper prize is yours. Bunny's honor. <gasps> With pleasure, Zipper. But hey, I got all of the recipes! I got them all! Yes, yes, I'm almost done, guys. I'm almost out of the woods! Oh, not that. Uh, where is it? Hold on, I got it. I keep forgetting. I gotta learn it before I actually start crafting it. You can't craft what you don't learn. You can't craft what you don't know, guys. Keep that in mind for all of you DIY crafters out there. So we've got it now, and what I'm going to do is, oh, craft this Russian doll babushka looking makeshift zipper toy. Anyway, great, great, definitely not creepy at all, he's uh, he's looking, looking fresh, looking fresh zipper. I've got nothing to say about that except interesting. That's an interesting thing to make. But I have crafted this thing in your likeness. So I hope you're happy with it. Oh, look at Eugene over there carrying his little bag. Aw, came back from a shopping haul even though Nook's cranny is closed already. Anyway, Zipper! That look on your face says it all. Did you really complete my tasks, both big and small? You crafted the wobbling zipper toy too? yippity yahoo I knew I could count on you. And I promise I didn't forget my promise. Congrats, here's your super spectacular prize. <gasps> what did I get? Oh, another recipe? Okay, it's a wonderfully wonderful recipe for a bunny day wand! <gasps> what do you mean, just another recipe? Sheesh, looking for a little gratitude here. After all this excellent crafting, I think one more bunny day cheer is in order. Are you ready? You're the winner. Yes, you are. Congratulations, you're a star. Oh. Hippity hop, the fun doesn't have to stop. The Bunny Day festivities will continue all day today, so go have a hop and good time. <gasps> and thanks for jumping in on my fun Bunny Day festivities. You've made me the hippity happiest bunny of all. I don't know why, but I wonder why I have doubts about that little fact. I don't think. I, I don't think that Zipper Tea Bunny is happy about all of this. Just my opinion, but uh, I have a feeling that on the inside, he's he's not doing so hot. He's uh, he's going through some stuff on the inside. But anyway, besides that, I won't question his sarcastic remarks that he whispers to the side. And I'm gonna place this little uh, this little thing that he gave me, or that I crafted myself for some strange reason. So what's a good place to put this? Wob wobbly zipper toy thing. Huh, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I think I will put it right here, right next to good old Papa Bear. Oh dear, wait, hold on. Sorry guys, I was not thinking. I forgot I have to learn this first. Okay. And now, moving on from that, I will put this wobbling zipper toy right here. Oh, look at that. Oh, 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 he. That is a. That is one, uh. One. Uh, hop. That is one interesting hop you've got there. One interesting boing. Wow. The boing. The boingness on this thing is quite intense. But anyway, besides that, I'm gonna casually step away from that thing over there for a second. For a hot second and uh, craft this bunny day wand. We've got a wand, guys! We have done it! We have officially, well not yet, but we have almost officially crafted every single item that Bunny Day has to offer. And I forgot that you need star fragments for Bunny Day, or for wands and stuff. But the wobbling zipper toy, I guess I could craft another one of those. 
No trouble, no trouble. I uh, where is it? Right there. Nice. So we got that. And what we can do from here is grab a few uh, star fragments and then we could craft ourselves a wand. Not like I'm going to use it since I'm already in my bunny queen outfit. But, you know, it's good to have on my person at all times just in case. So I have 11 star fragments. I've also got myself a little Aries fragment over here. But I need one more to make the Aries rocking chair. I think it's a rocking chair, but gotta make more wishes upon stars. I think the one thing that would make this bunny day the best bunny day ever would be seeing a bunch of stars or a bunch of meteors just shooting down from the sky. Like what if there was a meteor shower in the game on bunny day? That would be the best thing ever. Like I would love that. That would that would just put the icing on the cake, you know. That would that would make this night very very conclusive. But anyway, besides that, we have got a wand to craft. So Where's the wand? Right, uh... Excuse me? Where's the wand? There, there, there it is. Nice, 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 nice! Okay, we have got ourselves the wand. No, don't keep crafting. I have... No, I don't have anything else to craft. So we've got the wand, guys! We have got the wand! Yes, yes, yes! My setup is complete! And I guess a good way to end this video, since I am way over time, is I'm going to hold this bunny day wand, and I'm going to wave it around for you guys. Well, there you go. I waved it for you guys. So, uh, yeah. I guess that's the end for this one, for this um, adventure log. We have officially completed every task that there was to do in Animal Crossing for this bunny day season. And, uh... I just want to say I had a blast doing that, even though I kind of ruined it by collecting the eggs in advance. But I mean, who who wouldn't have already collected the eggs in the first place? I mean, you had an entire 12 days to do all of that, and you know, it's not really that hard. You just had to craft everything, which I also did in advance, but that's not the point. The point is, I had fun, and this was a very fun bunny day, and I hope you guys had a, an amazing bunny day as well. So I am going to end it here and stop running around my house in circles like a fool, and give you guys one last wave just because I feel like it. Thank you guys so much for joining me here on this happy, hippity, this hippity hoppity bunny day season. And I guess I will see you guys in another video. So stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for joining me here. And don't forget to stay tuned for the next video. I will see ya then.